Hello everyone, I'm cooking vegetables with meat today. Here I have two cloves of garlic. If they're small, you can make three or four of them. I've got um, one capsicum, um, one whole onion, and I've got three potatoes here. I have some green beans here. I've just washed it um, and I'll be using it amongst all these other vegetables. I also have a can of diced tomato. I'll be using this as well. Um, the meat is cooking with uh, oil. I'm using sunflower oil. You can use any oil you like. Yeah. Uh, in goes my capsicum, my onion, and my uh, garlic. I'm going to fry the saute them a little bit. And then I'll be adding to these other vegetables. I haven't added any salt or any spices at the moment. It's all going to come off because when you're Cooking the meat and you put the salt in first um, what's going to happen is the meat is going to release all its juice all at once and then you're going to be left with dry meat so instead I put the meat in my pan on medium heat with a bit of oil and colour it and let it cook for a little bit and once the the meat has changed its colour, then add all the um, ingredients like uh, your onions, your garlic and your capsicum. And once that is a bit more uh, cooked all together, then we'll be adding our potatoes and green beans. I think this is enough. If they all heat it up. Yeah. I've got my pressed tomatoes. I'm just going to pour it in like this. Okay. And give it a bit more stir. And turn up the heat a bit more. I've got it on high at the moment. I will cover it this and let it cook a little bit more. Yeah. Let's see how much it's cooked. Seems to be cooked enough. As you can see, all the vegetables have come together and the tomato has melted away. And now it's time to add my green beans. Making sure I've got all the bits. Okay, now we're going to just stir this. And now I'll be adding my um, roughly diced potatoes like this the big chunky pieces don't make them too chunky it's just um, enough for them to cook all nicely together it won't be nice if some vegetables are cooked and some aren't so, so. Oh, that goes 
see. Uh, this is my first recipe in English. If I get likes and subscriptions, there will be more of them. So I'm stirring this a little bit more on here. And I'm going to let it cook just a little bit, not too much. Then I'm going to add my um, salt and black pepper and red pepper. I'm not going to give measurements because it all depends on how many people you'll be feeding. And I'm sure you would know you can make the quantity yourself. So for now, I'm letting it cook. That looks very nice and colourful. Now it's time to give this meal's taste, which will be some salt. there's meat in it I like to add some oregano or oregano however you like to say it and some freshly ground black pepper don't make it too hot because some black peppers do taste hot so and I've got some flaked chilies. This is mild. You can you can use hot if you like to eat hot. This is mild. Now give it another stir. Uh, stirring is a bit of a problem for me because I've got some wrists and hand problems. But I still have to for my family. So I try to take my time as, as I'm cooking or preparing. But I still make it there. I get to feed people eventually. Take care of your health. Very important. Okay, now I'm going to cover this up again. And I will cook it until the potatoes and uh, um, the beans are soft to touch. I will test it before I turn off the stove. And yeah, that, that's it. I'm not going to add any water in it. So I'm going to turn this stove to medium heat now, which I did and let it cook in its own juices as you can see it is juicy okay so it's gonna cook on its own just in case it doesn't cook you can add a little bit of hot water so that, um, it is soft to touch the, the vegetables and it's edible now it's been simmering for about 10 minutes now as you can see it is still um, steaming now what I'm going to do I'm going to get some onto my plate okay I will be taste testing as you can see, the potatoes are cooked very nicely. Still very hot. The salt is really good. If you like salty, you can add a bit more. 
if not you, you don't have that any salt at all and this is the green beans let me taste this as well that's very good and a bit of meat mm, perfect this is my first English video so please if you watched my video and you liked it I'd like to get a thumbs up from you a sub subscription and maybe a comment as well thank you for watching my video hope to see you next time thank you bye bye